Oh, hello there. I'm Bilgen the Cute Bear. Hey there. I'm Nimikon and even cuter bear. Hey there. I'm Nimikon. A cute bear too. Ah. Uh, in today's class, we'll be talking about what equations are. And what it means to solve equations. Alright, got that. First, when we say equations. For example, this expression is an example of an equation in terms of x. Using this expression, I'll explain what equations are. I think I understand. An equation is an expression with x in it, right? On this expression. Transpose 2. Transpose 3x. And then divide by the coefficient of x, which is 2. And we'll get the value of x. Exactly, that's the correct way to solve an equation. So, what does that final value of 3 for x mean? That's the solution to this equation, right? Yes, that's right. Then, what do you mean by the solution to this equation? I am the all-knowing, all-powerful bear, Nimicon. Never thought about that before. Ah, uh, the solution to an equation for x means that if x has that value, then the original expression becomes true. What does that mean? For instance, in this original expression, if we substitute x equals 3, in other words, replace x in the expression with 3, what does the expression become? Um, the left side is 5 times 3 minus 2 equals 13. And the right side is 3 times plus equals 13. So it becomes 13 equals 13, right? Exactly. So 13 equals 13 is certainly a true equation. Uh. So this equation in terms of x is correct when x equals 3, right? Of course. But in this expression, what if we substitute x equals 2? Um, after calculation, it becomes 8 equals 10. So it's incorrect with x equals 2. Alright. What if we substitute x equals minus 1? Um, it becomes minus 7 equals 1, so it's still an incorrect expression. Exactly, you got it. An equation in terms of x is an expression like this with x appearing in it, and depending on the value of x, the expression can be true or false. So the solution to an equation in terms of x, like x equals 3 in this equation, is a value of x that makes the original equation true. I see, that's what it means. So since solving an equation means finding the solutions to the equation, it means to find the value of x for which the original equation becomes true, right? Exactly, you understood it well. Hee <laughs> hee. Ha, even though I said it first. You did say it indeed. <laughs>